They say every second counts in a disaster like a house fire, but you might be surprised to know that one of the biggest factors in how much time you have to escape your own home during a fire is the age of your house. And this is the unbelievable part. You actually have a lot less time to get out of a newer home. Our chief investigative reporter Morgan Lowe is joining us now with the details on this. Chris and Seen, it makes sense to think that newer homes are safer, and in a lot of ways they are, but not when it comes to fire. And if you live in a new home, you might want to take your family's escape plan and speed it up. There's incident commander requesting that. Saturday morning, January 12th, an apartment building in Mesa is on fire. 12 people trapped on the third floor. <laughs> okay, go, go, go. Firefighters are in rescue mode. This is just the latest example of how quickly a structure fire can become a death trap. And today, people actually have less time to get out than ever before. Here's why. This video from Underwriters Laboratories shows an older room on the left and a modern room on the right. A small fire starts in both rooms at the same time. But as we speed up the video, take a look at how much faster a modern room turns into an inferno. We may think, well, because of newer construction types, the technology makes it better for us to survive in fires. Well, that's actually opposite of that. With Mesa that, Fire uh, Deputy Chief Forrest others, Smith says it's modern furnishings and building materials to blame. Things like particle board, microfiber and polyurethane furnishings that catch fire faster and give off more toxic smoke than older solid wood and natural cloth. Your time to get out of a fire has actually decreased several times over. 30 years ago, you may have had 20 minutes to escape a house fire. Now, it's four minutes or less. Do families need to revisit their escape plan based on this information? Absolutely. We want people to have that conversation at home is, what are we going to do in the event of a fire or a disaster in our home, and how are we going to get out, and where's our place to meet? The most important step you can take is to create a disaster plan for your family and practice it. Two to four minutes is not a lot of time to get out, especially if you're waking up in the middle of the night to a smoke alarm. And the new rule of thumb for using a fire extinguisher is if it takes more than five seconds to put out the fire, get out of the house. Seen in Chris Beck.